Um, we'll get your Twitter out there. We're going to have GP Advo taking on Kenta. This is actually a matchup I actually want to see. I I honestly think Advo will take this, but that's kind of biased because, because Advo is, is, is a homie. If Advo takes this, I can't help but feel like it's just because of the player he is. Because uh, I can like, I don't know what the numbers are on the Fox Game & Watch matchup, but just based on how light Game & Watch is and how, how a lot of his moves have some uh, some serious lag, right. I kind of feel like he gets bodied. Like, that's just, uh, that might not be true. We'll see. Uh, we'll, I mean, I, I think I've seen this matchup before, but I just feel like, you know, an up air at, like, 80 right. <laughs> might kill. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah, no, no, no doubt. And, and plus, another thing, another thing that Game & Watch struggles is, like you said, his... His his low weightness, he can die super early, and Fox has a bunch of kill moves and kill setups. Right. So let's see what happens, but don't count Advo out. He's been placing high with his character, so let's see what, what he does. Exactly. I feel like he's going to handle this matchup rather well just yeah. because of the player he is. Yeah. And uh, Game & Watch has some tricks up his sleeve. Oh, yeah. So we'll see. Uh, starting this out on Smashville. Yeah, right now, we just have kind of a neutral yeah, right neutral now. Game, trying to, like, just poke. Rich again pokes right now. I feel like Kenta's gonna just try to use his data to kind of yeah. jump around, dance around, yeah, and just yeah. try to find his openings. Yeah, that definitely sounds like sounds like something Kenta would do. He'll just follow frame data and just try try to abuse it. But he also has to keep in mind, Advo should have that in mind because that is his main, and I Ooh, wish that was a nine. Got the eight. Yeah, it was one away from a nine, man. That would have been a stock if he had uh, if he had connected it. Probably, right. I'm not for sure on that, but I feel like that would have been an early kill. Oh yeah, no, no, no I, I think nine is an instant kill. Is right? it in this game? I think I, so. I don't know any of the information on the nine, but I know, yeah, it's pretty yeah. much like Russian roulette and it's right. death. Right. I think I think that's why Advo decided to go game watch this matchup because like since Fox is a fastballer, he can get. Wow. That was impressive. The I couldn't even finish what I was about to say. <laughs> right, yeah, I know. The shield pressure from that, and then he just down tilts, and, and he had no time to connect. Like That, that yeah. up smash comes out so quick, has very little lag, um, so he was able to catch him on the, off the shield there. Yeah, that was nice. Yeah, maybe Kenta next time will hold his shield for a little bit longer right. if he, he adapts. To, yeah, you have to keep in mind. Like, And also, ga game watch and up smash is just stupid in general. Like, it ha like his head is completely... It, it, invulnerable right so so when Kenta tries to do something to like challenge it it probably won't work because that because his head basically the entire hitbox during during that time yeah you have to be super careful when you're right. going up against that and uh, right now we see oh no he's gonna he ride the yeah, stage yeah, yeah, okay he's gonna, he's gonna be unfortunately Adva wasn't positioned uh, yeah. anywhere near to punish that but um we've seen that situation earlier and it cost Kenta a stock so that's risky business yeah all right getting landing the fall the falling bear I Kenta see. Stock. I see what Kenta is trying to do. He's trying to. Uh, no, not not Kenta. But what Advo's trying to do, he's just trying to force Kenta to approach so he can, so he can abuse the game and watch up smash and, and punish. Like, like I mean, you know, he's been using up smash a lot because he knows Kenta doesn't really know how to challenge it. Right. That and might uh, be it. That's gonna be it. Yeah, I was about to say that's exactly where Advo wants Kenta off stage because that's where Game and Watch really thrives. That's like that's where his best kill security comes from is going to be off stage right. and taking advantage of Fox's linear recovery. Yeah. So that's exactly what we saw there, kind of expending the credit card right there, <laughs> you know, maybe uh, purchasing a stock. Right. Like, like excuse me, I like like to buy that one stock right there. Yeah, I'd like to buy this win, please. <laughs> Put that right on my credit card. Thank you. Yeah. Credit to credit to GG Sup for that little. <laughs> that little me that uh, simile right there has a credit card. It's it's, it's neat. So uh, let's see where they go now. It looks like Duck Hunt, but no, Dreamland. Yeah, I was gonna say. Yeah, um, like, I, I don't think that Duck Hunt is the right place to go. Uh, not as a counter pick for Fox. Right. I, I feel like he definitely loves the try the tri platform stages. Yeah. Um, I'm surprised he didn't pick Battlefield. Oh yeah. I guess I guess he's what he's trying to do. My guess he's trying to. Get Advil on the top platform and poke him with up air. Yeah, he might feel like he can maybe get some earlier kills yeah. on the stage. Um, I can't remember about the blast zones. I don't want to say anything about him. Uh, I, I, I do actually. Sure. The, the same. The blast zones are the same as Smashville. Just that top platform is higher than than it is on Battlefield. So it kills. Ah right. yes, I believe that's correct. Yeah, yeah, that sounds about right. Yep. So right now he's just trying to find some up tilts. He's at the right percentage for some up tilt to do some good damage and put him in the air. Uh, but uh, he's not finding it right now. Advo just looking for all these aerials right now. Oh. All right. Oh, almost got the up air. That was a good jump. 
There you go. See what I say? He's trying to get, get early kills on, on, on that up air. Yeah, we see a lot of uh, we see Kenta putting out a lot of moves that are going to try to put Kent, uh, Advo in the air. For that reason, he wants exactly. to kill him off the top. So very good on you right there. GP Advo is trying to end this stock, sitting at 122. Yeah, he can if he plays his right. Oh my good. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Did you see that? Like, the, the wind box lifted him off the platform. He was still in free fall. He still couldn't do anything. Right. And at no rage, 0%, but at 132, only one puff killed him. Right. That I forget stupid. what they call that, but that, that was stupid. That was stupid. Yeah. This game is stupid. Why? That's why why do I still play this? Why don't I switch to Street Fighter 5? <laughs> <laughs> right. Yeah, I mean, Kenta kind of getting a few up tilts right now. Trying to bring this even yeah. this even right now. Right. Ooh, finding a five. I wanted that nine. No, oh, I think we all want that nine, don't we? Yeah. All right. That's good in there. Yeah, I mean, I don't think Kenta, that's where he wants to be on these platforms. No. no. Maybe he wants to find the ground. Okay, that was a good mix up coming with the side B. In this matchup on this stage, where it is now, none of them wants to be, be on, on a platform because cause they both have up airs that are just crazy. Yeah, and we see right there, um, he's getting these up airs, but I... Uh, Nothing, like, he's getting them, but it's not killing him. Yeah, it seems like Advo is able to just uh, air dodge, but he finds that one. He challenges the up air before the hitbox actually came out yeah. with the up air, so... It, That's it, exactly how I wanted to play the matchup. Yeah, it was a good attempt. I see what he's trying to do. I think he tried to go for a dare to send him upward and in the sock there, but he, would just, but he just mistimed it just, like, a little bit. He might have been able to intercept him, yeah. But uh, obviously yeah, yeah, the yeah, hitbox beat him. Off. Yeah, he was just all, either the hitbox beat him or he was just all off a little bit. A little bit of a party going on behind, yeah. behind our stream here. Right. Don't stop! Don't stop! There you go. All right. Well, everyone bobbing. I don't know if this, I don't know. All right then. Everyone kind of taking after Kenta here when he right. gets a win. <laughs> Alright, so we're going back to, to Dreamland. I can see why Advo took him back because it was a super close match. I guess Advo feels as though he just needs to do something a little, a little different to bring it back. I, I actually believe he can. Yeah, absolutely. I think this is within his grasp when he might use Dreamland for maybe a little bit of jank or maybe just try to get a, uh, like like what Kent is trying to do, maybe a kill off the top. Right. Um, he's going to make some adjustments, that's for sure. Aww. Well, that's, there. Yeah. We got, well, at least we got a 9. Yeah, at least we got it, right? We saw it. We see you, Advo. But uh, unfortunately, it, it wasn't a kill. Yeah, unfortunately, kind of caught in no man's land. Yeah. All right. Well, that was, that was nice. I, I will, to be honest, I probably would have got hit by that. Yeah, great awareness from Kenta just to hold his shield. That's what a lot of foxes do on the ledge, right? They like to just come up, they like to hold their shield, throw out a few up tilts. Right. Just kind of edge guard right there at the ledge, cover options. Almost it, but but like I said, he wasn't on, on, on a platform. If he was on a platform, then that probably would have been it. Right. Yeah, right now we're seeing a lot of edge guard opportunities from Kenta. As oh, that Advo. was a weird up smash. I guess he was going for a read oh, for a roll, but that's going to be it. Ooh, the puff puff takes the stock uh, again. And Advo off oh, with the dear. lead here. And like you said, um, they're both kind of playing similar game styles. They're yeah. both looking for their up airs off the top. So uh, Advo kind of playing to Kenta's game. Exactly. Oh. Wow. That This could be it. He just needs to throw that. This has to be it. This has to be it. He has to punish. Ooh. That was interesting. I'm surprised he didn't go for like an up air. I think that's what Kenta might have expected, but yeah. instead he just lands on the platform and grabs him. Yeah, I think I think I think he tried it so he can get, get wow. the first hit up air so he can hit, but it doesn't matter because he still gets it and Advo takes the set. Um you know what? Advo just took extreme advantage of Fox's side B. Right. <laughs> like he challenged